Right guys, I bought this today in the bargain store, Pound World I bought this. It's a spinning top that's got a clockwork effect to it. So you wind it up, it'll probably disappear off the screen, and then press the button and release it. Yep, off it goes. And I think it's actually supposed to have a LED in there that's going off. I don't think I could see it going just then. But that's not what I bought it for. I'm going to take it apart and see if I can use it to power a car. All I'm going to do is take take this piece off, glue that to the side of the wheel, wind it up and release it and see if that will make it drive up my kitchen. To make this work as quick and simple as possible I'll use one of my existing um, project chassis. I use on lots of my uh, ideas, test beds. So it's made from plastic conduit. I'll put a link I suppose to where I've used it before but I've used it in lots of different projects. So all I'm going to do is take this spinning top apart and hot glue that piece straight on the outside of that CD. And then we'll see if we can shoot it forwards. It's undone, but it's not coming out. Oh, there we go. That's better. So, that's the bit I want. And that's our bit of circuitry that should be flashing when it spins round. But I reckon those batteries are probably flat. Still, that might be a handy bit of circuitry for something else. So we won't throw that away. So, do I just hot glue it? Or do I actually drill some holes for these little pegs to go through to give it extra grip? Could do that, couldn't I? I'll either just snap them off and rely on the hot glue. I think I'll snap them off. Too much fuss drilling holes, but that would be an option. Right, we'll let that cool down and then we'll go and try it out. Test run time. Okay. Ooh. A lot of wheel spin there, wasn't there? We'll give this one last try. What I'm going to do is lift the wheels off the ground, get them spinning, drop the car back on the ground and the flywheel effect of the wheels spinning should drive the car forwards. Lift it, spin the wheels, drop the car. If 
full length of my kitchen, so about 5 metres. Not quite what I had in mind, but it works, sort of. Summary time, what have we got? We've got one of my test beds, one of my chassis that I use for all sorts of testing. We had a clockwork spinning top, that's the clockwork mechanism, and that red bit is the top of the spinning top. And all I've done is hot glued it to the back wheel, so we wind it up, press the button to start the wheels spinning, and then I'm dropping the car on the ground so that the flywheel effect of the wheels takes the car forwards. It's not working very well, but it does appear to have promise or potential. I think if I'd used heavier wheels, or maybe four or five of them together to give them extra weight, we'd get more of a flywheel effect and that'd carry the, wheel, the car forwards better than it is at the moment. But at the moment that's doing the five metres of my kitchen. So not quite what I had in mind when I picked the toy up, but it does work.